All right, here. Let me show you something. This is what I got. I got a haul from the Anaheim Thrift Store. I only went once to buy a belt from my brother's wedding. That was like a year ago, two years ago, something like that. It was a long time ago. Uh, but yes, uh, I got this. I don't have it on DVD, I have it on VHS. It has all the special features. That's why I got it. Normally it's for special features. So if I get things I already have on VHS, I like getting them on DVD for the explicit extended edition and normal edition. So I can have the comparisons. Much like these here. You know, Battlestar Galactica, Blade Runner, and uh, Brazil. So. Yes, yeah, so those are those two. So I'm going to watch those before I go to work. And then, also, I have this over here. Right now, I'm, I'm copying. Not selling, just copying. Now, this I've waited 10 years to get here. It's the... Yes, this does exist. It's called Bobby and... Bobby. Barbie and the Sensations Rockin' Back to Earth. And also, its companion story... Also included Barbie and the Rockers Out of This World. Fully animated. It's by High Top Videos. So, so it's a two episode, uh, 55 minute thing. Of Barbie, yes, Barbie, having her own, uh, well, her own cartoon pretty much. Because uh, apparently Jam and everybody else had things to contend with Barbie, but Barbie never really had her own TV show, of course, also she had to contend against with Maxie, so, yeah, eventually at some point someone wanted to do their own cartoon. Anyway, so right now I'm doing the Agatha Christie, Death on the Nile, which in a few uh, weeks or months will have the uh, Death on the Nile starring Quarrow instead of Agatha Christie, um, you know, but whatever. Uh, wait a minute. Agatha Christie's the writer. Wait, which one's this one? How is this? Hmm. I forget which one this is. Yeah, but then uh, Agatha Christie. Um. Wait, who's the lead? I don't think this is Poirot. I don't think. But whatever. Anyway, it's a murder mystery by Agatha Christie. It's, I'll, I'll figure that out as I watch it. Anyway, here is the Blues Brothers 2000 VHS. I got these for a buck. These were all like a dollar. The DVDs over there, those were the... Um, oh, that's my uh, $2 collection right there. <laughs> uh, this is the uh, VHS t uh, Blues Brothers 2000. It's a decent sequel. It's not terribly great, but it's good enough. It's good enough to be a sequel. No gripes about that. Um, too bad John Belushi died before it was made. He was originally supposed to be in Ghostbusters. But anyway, um, here is Chocolat. It's really good. It stars Johnny Depp, as you can see. And it's basically about this little quaint little town in, I don't know, somewhere in Europe. And these, uh, you know, the traveling band of gypsies that come down the, they call it the cut, I guess, or the river or whatever. And one of them sets up shop in, and is a chocolate salesman. Uh, she has a whole, like, display, like something you'd see at Christmas time or something. And she sells chocolate to various town goers and helps them with various different things. I particularly like the ending, bit of a spoiler here, but one of the, like, the, the mayor or whatever goes to her shop, breaks in in a fit of aggravation of racism starts tearing up the display like Godzilla in in Japan in Tokyo it starts wrecking the whole dang thing eats like, finds a tiny little bit of chocolate on his lip tastes it like he's never had chocolate before and he just starts eating parts of the display to the point where he passes out and he wakes up the next morning there's no dialogue in any of this he wakes up the next morning to the shop owner her uh, standing over him no judgment or anything just curiously looking at him he wakes up takes her hand and she leads him out of the display and gives him a thing of um, Alka-Seltzer to drink and he says he's sorry and then just 
she says all right and then he wanders off it's a fantastic film i love it anyway uh next we just have some stuff i just thought i'd get for you know the a dollar you know you know that that's that and i have the remake i don't have the original starring shirley temple <laughs> hollywood's own little starlet and the greatest movies ever yeah like that there we go and much much more that was it so it cost me all of 11 bucks for all those so i'm gonna sit back and watch this movie starring peter cushing and uh yeah this tower is getting a little bit big i have to do something about all that all that <laughs> yeah so that's that just wanted to show you what i got for a reasonably good reasonably good haul for a reasonably good price and there were tons more i'm gonna go back and get like a lot more all right so take care and see ya bye